so it's Monday afternoon and um, this isn't all of it. I had a load of bits picked up today from a UPS man and that is going via UPS. Sorry, that one there. And the one below it is also going via UPS. <sighs> um, cracking week. Postman is, uh, well, the, the post office is not going to like me much tomorrow morning. But yeah. Let's go back a couple of hours and you'll see what our total was. Another week is done and dusted. I am well aware I look absolutely shattered. It's because I am. So, seven day total. 1,007, no, and there's not a 700. I wish there was. 1,076 pounds and 57 pence. So there's a few items which I haven't showcased because I packed them up literally 10 minutes ago and forgot to say I sold this so the other uh, day the other week last week i think i bought three media items uh, like players i put all three on auction one of which didn't sell had a start price of five pound i think i think everyone had a start everything had a start price of five pound and i paid 10 pound plus fees for the lot so the the sony mdp 222 gx multi-disc player sold for 18 pounds plus postage everything was listed as 100 percent genuinely untested because that was the case i just wanted rid because they're big bulky and a wife had me buy the uh short and curlies so the yeah that one sold for 18 the panasonic nv vhd 1b s which is a vhs recorder slash dvd combo sold for 36 pounds plus postage the other one, as I say, did not sell. So I've, for no work, apart from taking some stupid pictures and the Frankenstein's monster of packaging, which I've done, no no, no work required. I, I didn't have to piss around trying to get a remote leads, etc., etc. Uh, with it being Christmas, it's busy. As I'm sure everyone is aware, it's bloody busy, especially with me only doing this part-time. I've got a full-time job as well, hence why my eyes are tearing through yawning so much and just living off of caffeine at the moment. So I just wanted rid, which I know I could have made more money if I tested it, list as parts not working, blah, 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 buy it now, whatever. Nah, can't be bothered. It's just got to go. So, yeah, a thousand pounds in a week again, which my my 31-day total is a thing of beauty it's four and a half grand and i've got to go to an auction house to pick up some money from a load of stuff that i sold which i just could not be bothered to list to be fair it was the trading cards okay it was the bulk trading cards i took the good ones out of pretty much everything um there was a few horror cards in there so someone's gonna make some money uh so that sold for about 260 pounds so yeah Oh my god, right, without further ado, let's go back in time, roughly six and a half days, and pick up from where we left off last week. For fifteen ninety five plus postage, we have sold Beast, Marvel's Beast, um, age four plus, Infinity Series, or Infinite Series, come from the amazing mystery box, I believe. So yeah, that pays for a good chunk of that box that I got six months ago. Another two ice moulds, twelve ninety nine, including free delivery, owes me, again, a couple of pound each. I am flying through these at Christmas, which is stupid. They should have gone in the summer. Iron Man Funker Pop, number 555, sold it for £22, plus postage. I think it owes me around about a tenner or so. Um, just FYI, there's not really a great amount of money to be made in Funker Pops, generally speaking, unless you wait for it to go out of production, quote-unquote, vaulted. And um, that's when the, the price tends to jump. So from a reseller's point of view, it's not really worth it because they take up a lot of room and people can be very, very picky when it comes to the condition of the box. So just bear that in mind. On the DS, we have sold Cooking Mama for $8.99, including free delivery. Goes to the large letter, which makes life a lot easier. On the PSP, we've sold Toy Story 3 for $12.99, I think, including free delivery again large letter nice and easy on the xbox 360 for 249 including for delivery we have sold tom clancy's conviction 
Um, I need to take that sticker off. But yeah, that did not owe me a pound. I'm fairly sure I actually got it for 50p. Even so, not really worth it. But once again, feedback fodder. I'm going to hit that 2k very soon, I hope. No, I'm not. I'm only on 1500. I want more stars. Hold on, the DVD because it's me. I always sell DVDs. Uh, Anastasia, 299, including free delivery. I should really turn this round because everything's upside down. Um, what am I looking for? Fox and the Hound, uh, 399, including free delivery. Sold the Builder Man, Builder Man, Builder Bear, Spider Man for 14.99 posted. Could have got more for him. I wanted to have gone quick because I've got far too many soft toys and they're just an absolute pain. Take up loads of room because they're so big and fluffy. So, not a lot of money, but quick flip. So it's Wednesday. I've just got to the stores to load up for some stuff for tomorrow for work. Also picking up two orders while I'm here. So my last Pterodon. 34.99 plus postage so you can pick these up in your local smith stores for 20 pounds my local one has none left i left one behind when i initially picked these three up a few days ago and went back today and they had none left so that's worth looking out for if you can get hold of one and i sold this for about 15 pounds i think it owes me around about five pound or so so yeah that's it i'm going home fingers crossed that i should be back just in time for Isabella's bath time. So it's Thursday morning, which means it's post office run time. A um, few parcels, nothing major. Probably about 200 quid's worth, which isn't bad. Maybe maybe 250, 300, I don't know. I'm tired. Someone was awake throughout the night. But she's going to nursery today, so fingers crossed she will sleep very, very well tonight. I might go to bed early. God, I'm old. It's three we've sold. There it is. Need for Speed Hot Pursuit. Three or four, ninety-nine, including free delivery. Yeah, no idea. On the Xbox 360, we've sold Gears of War 2 for three pounds forty-nine, including free delivery. So picked up last week for a fiver. Sold it this week for seventeen ninety-nine, including free delivery. It is. Rocket League on the Xbox One, the Collector's Edition. Okay, should have another one of these. Twelve ninety five, including free delivery. Owes me about three pounds, and it will go as a large letter. Queen takes Bishop, Loot Crate exclusive, nine ninety nine, including free delivery. Owes me a quid. So these were picked up on Thursday. I think I've got a footage of me buying these. I bought them for fourteen ninety nine each, which, admittedly, yes, is on the expensive side. Apparently there was a third one which sold and it was like a tartany type colouring. I've not seen one of those online so I'd imagine that's probably quite expensive. But $14.99 I reckon I could probably not quite double my money. Make a good like 80-70% on top. So those were $14.99 each. Brand new with tags. Nightlife. Sorry Nightmare. $2.99 from quite an expensive part of the world actually and it's complete got it all out yesterday everything is there should be able to get between 50 and well between 40 and 60 pounds a vivid voltage etb um will probably open up that at some point in the near future we sports big case edition two pound um i think I have to double check i think it's around 15 to 20 pounds at the moment and ps3's wwe all stars pay two pounds i think it's about seven to ten pounds including free delivery so not mega bucks but it's not gonna stick around for particularly long during this q4 period so yeah um not a lot so far picked up but fingers crossed that will change For $17.99, sold this Marvel Battle World. Uh, this is the only way of getting the negative Spider-Man. And I paid 
nine pounds from Tesco's. So seventeen ninety nine plus postage for this. So I think I bought four of them. Um, excuse the the objects which are littered around. It is currently Isabella's birthday, and she's fingers crossed about to have her first nap of the day, so we can actually eat. Twenty four ninety nine plus postage for these blue caramel men's boots. As you can see, barely worn. I can't remember what I paid. I think it was this year. I think it was eight to ten pounds from one of my regular suppliers. So they were bought really to keep them sweet and nice that they have now sold. I also had delivered a piece of cardboard. Not just one piece of cardboard, two pieces of cardboard. And in the middle of two pieces of cardboard is another piece of cardboard. Um, it's a Pokemon card, but not your average TCG Pokemon card. This is a Topps Chrome card. It's my last one. It's the last card I needed to complete the set. I've now completed series one, two, and three, which goes from uh, Bulbasaur up to Mew. Current asking price for that, that exact, what I've just said, Bulbasaur to Mew, 3,000 pounds. And I've just completed it. I've got spares. I'm gonna go into more detail on this one at a later date because this also does kind of tie in with my record sale of turning 10 pounds into two and a half grand it's, it's somewhat related to that so um i've got spares i've completed the set myself which i am overjoyed about to be honest with you um but yeah time to start cooking and then packing up as well because i've got i've sold a few items and i need to get it done Lego set number 31094 sold for 22.95 plus postage. Uh, no idea what it owes me because I've had it for a while. All I did was price match and then just sit and wait. So this owes me 80, sold it for 150 including free delivery with the 50% off with pack link obviously. UPS gonna cost me half of the price, three pound, three pound 50 or so. It's the Pure Evoke H4 Prestige in black. So yeah. 80 quid into give or take about 140 not including fees sold a ps3 with one controller and all the cables for 90 pounds including free delivery once again half price pack link is going to get used on the ps4 seven days to die sold for 29.99 including free delivery work that out someone bought it for 19.99 and i'm selling it for even more and as you can see popping that little scuff there it's a damn nice disc. On the Xbox One, that Minecraft game I bought last week for a fiver, sold it for 30 quid, including free postage. Sold it for a second time. It is the GameCube adapter, which basically allows you to play some games online, even way back then. Sold it for 18.99 plus postage. It came out as a part of a bundle where I got the Japanese Spice Orange GameCube. Okay, so we are back in the storage room, which is far too messy for my liking. Uh, first up, we have sold um, to Mr. Potato Heads for, I'm just gonna move it out the screen so that I can look at the price, 19 99 for all four. I think they owe me approximately a pound each. So these are well worth looking out for. Right, next up is, Let's just move these over to here. Oh, I've one's falling down, damn it. Right, so let's just move that out of the way because we've done that. Astro Boy light up figures times two. Going via the GSP, there's only one here, which means the other one is at home. Um, 55 and 94, including, I don't know, plus, Plus postage. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, that's a concern. With that Astro Boy, I've got a lot more online than I believe I have here. And I'm fairly sure I've only got a couple at home, which is, as I say, a bit concerning. Um, I don't believe I've misplaced any. Let's see if there's any more loot crate crap. No, but that's, oh, I'll take a Queen's Take Bishop home because I've sold one of those. So much of a restock. Huh. No idea. Right, so we've sold a Parasaur going via the GSP. 
um, for $39.99. And then one of the smaller ones, I believe it's a Triceratops, which is going to be in the box below. Um, that sold for, it's a battle damage one, sold for $24.99. Just move that out of the way. Oh, that's the only thing with these. It's, it's a very tight fit. Uh, Triceratops, which is there. There we go. Uh, that was $24.99. Right, let's go this in my rucksack and go home. See, I knew I had more Astro Boys lying around somewhere. Silly James. On the Wii, we have sold Ratatouille for six. 99 including free delivery hold up we're breaking the bank again we've sold i'm hoping it's it there it is 300 dvd 199 including free delivery i'll say it before i said it again generally speaking i won't go out of my way to to buy individual dvds but if you get loads at like 50 pence each you'll get some that are worth two pound three pound four five six whatever it may be so you just take the rough with the smooth Case in point, Moana has sold for four ninety nine, which would have cost me, again, 50 pence thereabouts. Call of Duty, Donny Walsh Ruin, brand new and sealed, 1999 plus postage, came in one of the amazing mystery boxes as far as I can remember. Harry Potter planner set for 39 99 including free delivery. Genuinely, no idea how much I paid. I think I've had it for quite a while so um yeah absolutely no bloody idea what it owes me but 40 pound is 40 pound for 64.99 plus shipping a one day pack link the sega mega drive flashback paid 30 pounds this year i believe must have been the start of the year i did have the intention to keep it but i just don't need it so it is going and it's gone Bought today being Sunday for £1.50, sold it for £9.99 including free delivery. Last one I sold, I think I sold it for £6.99. So yeah, put a few more quid on it and it sold within a few hours. So some idiot put this on a seven day auction. Um, that idiot being obviously me. Thankfully it sold for £10 plus postage, which is roughly what I wanted to get for it anyway. So um, I don't know if it's just me, but I have had issues with eBay not doing what I'm asking it to do, mainly in regards to printing labels for postage, not normally for creating a listing. Opal sold in the stream, Sunday Waffle, uh, $12.99 free postage. I did have an inquiry asking me to do it for £11 all in earlier on in the day, but lo and behold, it's sold for the full whack, so that'll be going out Tuesday morning. So it is Monday morning, and it's been a fairly busy few days, to be honest. Um, I think our seven-day total is going to be over a grand again, but, you know, tied from the thumbnail clickbait will tell all that. Uh, everything is going out tomorrow, apart from that, that, and that. We saw UPS was getting picked up today between 8 and 5. Thankfully, the wife is working from home, so she can be around to deal with that. Um, yeah, it's... Um, it's it, it's all the way down there. Oh, what's all that? There's there's games I haven't put away yet, and there's balloons left over from Isabella's birthday. Um, yeah. So busy, busy, busy. But it's going to the post office tomorrow. Um, otherwise the post office gets a little bit upset, which I can understand why, because that's a lot of big parcels. Um, obviously these ones aren't much of a problem. There's only two little green ones this week. What's all that about? But yeah, fairly sure our seven day total is going to be around about a grand or so which yeah is not bad whatsoever winter sports 2009 brand new and sealed sold for 14.99 including free delivery i think it owes me maybe a pound we've sold two more beanies which nope that that's a sock that's that's a beanie uh two different people for 12 pound 90 each including free delivery owes me about three to four pounds from yesteryear. SpongeBob 999 posted owes me 50p. Lovely. Galarian Dimension V Max from the Vivid Voltage set sold for 999, including free delivery. Uh, again, I 
honestly forgot that I listed such a low value card to sell on its own, my mistake. One, two, one, two, three, four.